long time in the midst of a new job and her busy life, so we really appreciate that. Well, I'm going to wear my chamber hat now for a minute or two. Um, many of you in the room are members of the chamber, so I don't need to preach to the choir. You understand the value and all of the great things that we offer. But if you're not a member of the chamber, I really want to encourage you to consider it. What the Gettysburg Germantown Chamber is all about is opportunities. We provide you opportunities to get together, to network, to meet potential clients, to grow your business, to have resources, to um, expand your business, or whether you're new or you're an existing larger business. We're all about opportunities. We're a really great chamber in this particular group, Women Balancing Life and Business, um, as Dawn had explained earlier, is a fairly new committee within the chamber. The quarterly luncheons, the Lunch and Learns like today, are open to chamber members and non-members, but our monthly conversation and connections, and you got a little taste of that um, at the very end today where we had some sharing and ideas, but it gets much more open. We have what we call very gut-level honest discussion about all of life. So um, that is for chamber members only. It is a benefit and a value of becoming a chamber member. So if you're interested in that, I'd really encourage you to consider becoming a member for many of the reasons I've said. Um, and it's great for your business. It's great for you as a person. And we hope you'll consider it. So I want to thank you for coming. If you have any questions about the women's group or about the chamber, feel free to see me afterwards. You're welcome to stay and network a little bit. And I want to thank Marilyn for allowing us to have this group and uh, bringing us all together. So thanks so much. Mm -hmm. well, sorry, I want to thank Lisa Landers for the, all of the Go Red pins and for um, bringing the opportunity for us to acknowledge that today. You know, Heart disease is the number one killer of women in this country, and that's unfortunate, especially you know, when you think it surpasses things like breast cancer. So um, wearing red is a good reminder. It's an important issue, and you want to get out there and take care of your heart and take care of yourself. Thank you. Mm -hmm.